Bonjour la famille, I greet you in the mighty name. Name that we receive above every name. It's not the name of it's not the name of man, but it's the name of Jesus Christ the Nazareth. And thank you because we know you get it soon. I'm here today with my brother, the servant of God, a disciple, yes, of Jesus Christ in true in spirit. We are here wanna speak about the word of God. We yeah. wanna share the word of God because the word. It's God, the time we are speaking about the word, we are speaking about Himself, the owner of everything. Yes, I think so, uh, but I guess I have some word that you want to give to us, share with us, we try to discuss about the word. Yeah, uh, thank you, man of God, for the word. And uh, before we start everything, uh, I want just to reach you to tell you that God loves you and that God is there for you. Amen. Uh, any things that come in your way, any circumstances, uh, matters, uh, problem that you are facing today, God is with you. You just uh, put your belief and your faith in God so that God can continue to protect you and uh, to keep you safe. Before we start our, our service, I can call it service because uh, we are about to shift in the spirits. We are going to pray to tell God that God, we need your praises. We need everything that we can do here. Let your presence be with us. Amen. We are going to pray in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. Our Heavenly Father, we bless you. Father, we thank you for this great moment in your presence. You let your you holy name be glorified among your, your people. Father, we bless your name be glorified among us. Your word you are saying. The Bible says the that our words are gathered together, Father. You are gathering together. You are on them, Adonai. That's why we bless your presence. I believe that your presence is here. I believe that your presence is about to be glorified. The bless of Jesus. You are the God who is giving the revelation. Oh, Father, we need the revelation of the word. Thank you, oh Father. In the mighty name of Jesus, God, uh, in the mighty let name your holy name be lifted up, Father. Father. Bless, yeah. You have received the name who is above Father, all the names. Uh, let every knee shall bow down before you, you Lord. Yeah. That's why we came Thank in you your, your presence, presence to acknowledge your presence. Oh, Father. That's why we are here to acknowledge Lord, your presence Lord, and your mercy. Lord, let your name be glorified in this hour. Let your name be glorified in this hour, Adonai. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, so much. In the mighty name so much. of Jesus, but I grace for for the moment of prayer. We know that the the key to open doors is a prayer. Amen. Amen. I mean, the time you are starting with the prayer means you are waiting something not in the hand of man, because you are waiting something God to do something new in your life. Amen. 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 Yes, we want to speak about the word of God. I think so. We we, we try to, to 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 speak about a lot of things about the word of God because if today you see a man starting not physical but was doing spiritual things I mean God the man because the word of God says the word of God says God the truth man in man is not the flesh but it's the spirit that is in of us Amen. means we are getting something that is so great than flesh is the word of God in of us Amen, amen. Yes, uh, come on, man of God. We are there to show you, to tell you that don't look at the position or the condition of life that you have because you, you, you don't put your faith in men, but you are putting your faith in God who is attracting through you. God because God. I like with some way that my brother Eric says the difference between faith and hope means. If you are going to school, you are going to learn something that you can attract up to everything that you do. Amen. But the time you have nothing in your hand, you have to attract faith. Amen. Oh, the faith is coming always the time you are receive the word in true in spirit. Because the word of God is is attract means is, is creating faith inside of us. Amen. Amen. Means the true faith. It's the time when you are listening the word of God because the word of God says the faith is coming just the time man start to listen something. Amen. Or you can attract good, you can attract bad according to what you are listening. Yes, I, uh, I, I give the word to my brother because I think you have some word that I want to share with us according uh, the difference between hope and faith. The Christianity, we are not connecting to hope, but we are connecting to faith. Amen. Because the time we have faith means we are representing the kingdom of God. 
Patricia, welcome with the word to one again. I, I thank God for this uh, big revelation, and, uh, mighty revelation. Uh, man of God, may God bless you. Hallelujah. May God continue to bless you more I and to it. put his, uh, his anointed upon you I in order for it. you to receive more the revelation. Hallelujah. So something that I, um, when you are about to talk, Amen. when you start talking, Amen. I feel something um, come. Mm -hmm. Inside of me, Amen. and I start to realize that uh, every Break. time that we are talking about God, Break. Mm -hmm. God is there. Hallelujah. Means that when we start talking about Him, mm -hmm. He decides to leave everything mm -hmm. to come and listen how human be understand me. Hallelujah. So I go back to the book of Genesis. I realize that uh, the image of God inside of a human being is to represent His way. Hallelujah. Break it. Oh, Hallelujah. God is so powerful. God Hallelujah. is so powerful. When I understand the word, when I come close to the Bible, mm -hmm. I realize that the Bible is just the part of the word of God. Mm -hmm. But God is so big than the Bible. Amen. That's why when you read the Bible, re you realize that uh, they are talking about just God in the different ways. Amen. But they, they are not touching God in the fullest way the full of his glory mm -hmm. because oh, when you oh, see oh, the oh, glory oh, of God oh. is beyond what man can think hallelujah mm. you know the, I, I, I feel like I have had a inside of me I think so you didn't finish your word mm. because I, I, I start to realize that uh, mm. the word of God hey, man. the Bible mm. the Bible is just a, a book that uh, contain the word of God hey, man. But the word of God is big than the Bible. Amen. That's why we can start by Genesis up until the Revelation. They talk about the things that will happen, but they're not talking about the Creator. Amen. Because when you talk the Creator, you will never understand who is God. Mm -hmm. Because when I go to the book of Genesis, the Bible said that in the beginning, mm -hmm. God creates means that uh, in the beginning of the universe, mm -hmm. God has created, but, but there is a beginning of the beginning. Amen. Means that God is out of the time. Amen. Ah, hallelujah. You know, I like God I, is I, out I, of I, the I, time. I, 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 I like it. Because the way you are saying, I'm going to connect him, I feel like they are taking me out of this place. They are bringing me in the connection of the revelation of the word of God. Talk. Hallelujah. Because. Mm. The word of God is not the revelation that men have to work on it. Yeah. But if you want to know the true word of God, you have to dwell in the revelation. Because the revelation of the word is too big more than the Bible. Yes. You see? Because the men, that's why you see a lot of men. Let me give this example to our brother Muslim. The Muslim, they are working according to the Bible. Hallelujah. By the Christianity, we are connected to mm. the revelation of the word. Go deeper. Or yeah, to, yeah. to have the revelation of the word, you have to know the best that we are calling Jesus Christ in the Nazareth. Hey, hallelujah, hallelujah. Because the way, hallelujah, God is so powerful, man. Because Genesis, uh, Genesis in the beginning, the way you are saying, mm. Genesis showing us that the beginning of man, not the beginning of God. Hey, but if you want to know God, you have to go to connect to the revelation. Or the revelation is meant to be out of the flesh. Amen, you see, amen, the time amen. you enter in the revelation, you start to dwell in the revelation, means amen. you are out of the flesh. Amen. You are going to connect you with your own and that have to reveal you the things that is hiding from you. Hallelujah. Us God is so we powerful. Are blessed, so God. We are blessed. We are we are we are we are we are so blessed. Amen. We are Hallelujah. so blessed, man of God. When I see how the spirit of God inside of you. Mm -hmm. Allow you to navigate, Hallelujah. not to see what is inside the Bible, Amen. but to see what the Spirit of God reveal you about the Bible. Amen. Mm -hmm. So when when the Spirit of God give you the revelation before the Bible, mm -hmm. means that uh, that's why I love Jesus Christ. Amen. Mm -hmm. He said that uh, uh, Moses. There was a time when the people of Israel. Mm -hmm. Come, Jesus, and say that you, you are too young mm -hmm. to talk about these things. Mm -hmm. And Jesus, I like the response of Jesus because Jesus said that uh, before. Hallelujah. The Jesus doesn't talk about uh, something that is in the present, mm -hmm. but he said before mm -hmm. 
your father Abraham. Hallelujah. I am. Hallelujah. Means that uh, God is not measuring about the timing because the timing is about just a human being because we are living under the earth or under the heaven because heaven is something that is up Good. up uh, up mm. that's uh, we are living under uh, you are living up on the earth mm. but the heaven is up so so everyone is living up on the earth is controlling his life by the timing mm -hmm. we have 24 hours out of 24 hours there is no minutes mm -hmm. means that with is 24 hours mean that uh, we are living a day but God is more than what we are saying Hallelujah. because himself is the time it can never be controlled by the time how the time control a human being but God is the master of the time mm. that's when we talk about the timing we see men walking under the time mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. when we start talking about God God is after the time let me say something man of God God bless you because you are can going, I bring something there? You, okay, come, come, man of God. He said that God is up, is out of the time. Mm -hmm. There is something in the Bible in Matthew chapter 5. The Bible said this. I want you to be perfect. Yes. As me, God, I'm perfect. Mm -hmm. Oh, in the Bible, when you read the Bible, you find out that the Bible said, Who is a man? So, who, can, who is a man to think about God? Who is a man? To have the same mind as God. You find out that in the Bible, the thinking of God is not the thinking of man. Hallelujah. So, I want you man to be perfect as me, God, I'm perfect. Which means, God is asking you something impossible. Hallelujah. Yes, yes. 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 Uh -huh. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, yes. So, yes. if God asks you something impossible, which means there is a way to make it possible. Hallelujah, hallelujah. So, you find out that... We are not reading the Bible because we pray. Mm -hmm. Yes. We are not reaching something because we pray. But we are reaching something with God because there is a grace of God upon us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Which means it's not anyone who is allowed to read the Bible. It's some, there is something that's alone with God. You know, we are going to church. Yeah. But there are things that we need to know. There are people who are going to church because they have called. God called them to church. Yeah. There are three things. There are people who go to church because they need God called them. We are going for call. Secondly, we go for appointment. Yes. They are those ones who go for a meeting. Hallelujah. So there is many ways to receive God, but only one way to see God. Mm -hmm. To receive is another thing, and to see Him is another thing. The thing is, perfection, that's the hardest things. But to be perfect with God, you need the grace of God. Hallelujah. God is asking you something impossible. Some way, some are. We reach perfection, but we don't know how, when we reach perfection. There is something I learned. Perfection is the matter of maturity and completeness. Hey, man, let me go forward, man of God. Break it. I, I want to go back to the word that mm. our brother Chris gave us according. What I can wanted to show us two different of things that I, I, I'm still meditating of, on mm. it. Between eternity, eternity mm. and time. Because means God give men time. Mm -hmm. yeah. God is out of time because God is living forever. Mm, yes. Before men go to reach God, men have to go to reach to, to have the, 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 the image of eternity. Yes. Means I like to say it in my language. Let me try to say something in my language. Yes. Because I think so in French I miss some way that I have to say. Language of this is vous voyez, il y a des différences entre le temps et l'éternité. Yeah, Dieu n'est pas dans le temps, mais le temps est là pour contrôler l'homme. Mm. Yes. Parce que c'est si tu veux rencontrer la personne de Dieu ou bien la personne de Jésus-Christ, mm. il faut que tu sois dans, le, dans une partie de l'éternité. Or, mm. comment l'homme entre dans l'éternité pendant que l'homme mm. dort Parce que c'est pour rencontrer Dieu, pour avoir une communication avec Dieu. C'est pendant que l'homme est out of time. The time you are out of time, it's very easy for you to communicate with God. Hallelujah. But the time you are in time, it's very hard for you to understand God. Hallelujah. But if men want to know the truth of the word of God, you have to go out of time. Yes. In out of time, you allow you to write something new that you show people that the place I'm coming from is not about time there. 
It's about the eternality life. Means in these two things, men is living according to time. Right. Because God gave time of men for men. But God is out of time because it's eternity like God. Yes. yes. Which, which means when you talk about time and eternity, mm -hmm. there are two things I just find out. Mm -hmm. I find out that creation is another thing. Mm -hmm. And the universe is another mm -hmm. thing. When we talk about creation, we talk about God, the one who made everything. Mm -hmm. You find out that creation is an it's a unlimited space. Where a drop of the space, we call it universe. The creation is a space God is not a man. When a man starts to bring God in what he's doing, which means he doesn't understand. You can't bring God in what you are doing, but you need to go in what God is doing. As brother Ima said, he said that God is in the eternity as we are in the time. But most of the time, we need God to leave space come. to come to our time. Come on. But God already did it a long time. Amen. Come on. God find out that a man was in the trouble. Mm -hmm. It was difficult for God to come to a time of man. Mm -hmm. He sent prophets. He sent many things to do the work, but they fell. Until God has to come to the time of man in the form of Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. That the impossible work that he has to do. God has to lose all his power to become a man. Because to live in the time, you need to become powerless. Because the time doesn't need power. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. time needs a man to be powerless. Mm -hmm. So you can live in the time. So you can be a mortal person. You are calling to die. That's right. That's right, man. I'm sorry. Uh, mm -hmm. I want to I wanna put something there. Mm -hmm. I like to say this always to say the time God speaks, mm -hmm. we see Jesus Christ. But the time Jesus Christ speaks, we see men. Because mm -hmm. the, pendant que Dieu parle, nous voyons Jesus Christ. Mais pendant que Jésus-Christ parle, nous voyons l'homme. 